Hi, welcome to my video. What are we going to have in iNav 1.9? This version will feature a lot, really a lot of bug fixes, but there will be also a few interesting new features. One of these new features is going to be manual flight mode. Powell made a very good video, you can see a link to that video in description about manual flight mode, uh, but to highlight what the manual flight mode is, it's a replacement for pass-through mode featuring configurable rates, expo and such things. So you won't be you won't have to configure everything in your TX. Just configure manual flight mode on a switch. Configure expos rates in your flight controller and you are fine. Next major feature in INF 1.9 is improved accelerometer calibration. Right from the beginning, when we introduced six points accelerometer calibration, it was a major problem for users because many have trouble doing it. So we created this new interface in the configurator, which guides you through the process. Another interesting feature worth mentioning is ability to choose between built-in and external compass sensor. For most boards this feature is irrelevant, but there are some that have a built-in compass on uh, one hardware interface and external compass and the possibility to connect external compass to an another hardware interface. And up to version 1.9 iNav was unable to choose between built-in and external compass. We fixed that. Now there is a setting in the CLI which allows you to choose between built-in and external compass sensor. In the next video we'll talk about reliability. Flyaways, crashes, reboots in air, brownouts, etc. 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 Thanks for watching. Bye! Fly safe!